Okay, so here we have a ditty sheet. The ditty sheets all look very similar in their setup. They're numbered slightly differently, but they all start with a speed sound box, a green word, and then some, especially a little bit later on, will have a red word box. So you're going to focus on this area of the sheet first, okay? So, uh, to start off with, you'll have a go with your child at reading the speed sounds in and out of order. Are you ready, Lani? Okay, Lani, I'm going to jump around now. You ready? Okay, so the idea is here that we're getting the children to be as familiar as possible with the sounds that they need to know for this ditty. Then we move on to the green words. Lani, I'd like you to Fred talk, read the words, please. Lani, pretend you don't know this one. Okay, so at this point, I would help Lani by joining in with her and trying to say the sounds and blend the word with her. Let's do it again together. Ooh, Good girl. And by really emphasising how I would blend that together, I'd hope she'd pick it up. As Lani gets better at these words, we can maybe try and jump around and not Fred talk them. Should we see if there's any that you don't need to Fred talk? Good. Excellent. Should we Fred talk it? Okay, so obviously the quicker they know the sounds by sight, without Fred talking, the better. But if they do get stuck, just go back and encourage them to Fred talk again. That's fine. Then we'll spend a bit of time looking at the red words. Red words are words that you just have to know. Okay, we know this one, don't we? I. I. Let's have a look at this one. It says me. me. If we Fred talk it, it's m, eh, me. That's not a word, is it? So this is a red word that we just have to know. Me. 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 Me, me, me. Me, me, me. So we practice saying it in lots of silly voices so that it stands out in the children's memory. Okay, now we've spent a bit of time looking at what we need to know to be able to read our ditty. We can have a go at reading it. Okay. Lani, I want you to read it, but if you're not sure, have a go at Fred talking. I am a cat. Good girl. I am wet. Brilliant. Fred talk. A U A U A Let me in. Brilliant. Fantastic, Lani. That was great. So I'm going to read it now back to Lani with a nice bit of ex um, expression in my voice. Can you follow as I read, Lani? I am a cat. I am wet. Let me in. Okay, Lani, I'm going to read now and I'm going to miss some words, okay? You follow and see if you can jump in and say the words that I don't say. I am a cat. Brilliant. I am wet. Let me in. Good job. Okay, so we've spent a bit of time. If Obviously, if your child is not picking it up as quickly, you'd go back maybe and have a look at here. You might want to turn some of these words into little individual flashcards um, so that you're really helping them become more and more familiar with those words. At the bottom of the sheet here, we have questions to talk about really straightforward. It's about getting um, your child to fully understand what they've read. So the question I'm going to ask you, Lani, is why does the cat want to come in? Because he's wet. He's wet. How do you think the cat might be feeling all wet outside? Sad. Sad and a little bit? Cold. A little bit cold. What do cats like to feel? Warm. Warm and cosy, yes. Lovely. Instead of just soaking wet. Instead of just soaking wet, yes. I think if I was soaking wet, I'd like to come in too. 
Okay, and then the final thing that you need to do for uh, your ditty sheet is your hold a sentence. Okay, the hold a sentence is here. At this point, I take the sheet away so that Lani can't see it. So she, we're going to practice together remembering the sentence she wants to write. So have your paper ready, but we're going to, my turn, your turn this. Are you ready? It says, I am wet. Your turn. I am wet. 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 Can you remember the sentence on your own? What is it? I am wet. Should we count how many words there are? I, I am wet. wet. Three words. What do we need in between each word? Do you think you could have a go at writing it? Off you go. I, new word. your Fred fingers. Wet. Okay, so you've got your were. What's next? Uh. Good girl. Wet. Good girl. And there we have Lani's sentence all written. Shall we check that it's right? I'll write it. So you can see if yours is the same. Have you got the eye? Give it a tick. Have you got a? Uh, mm? Give it a tick. Have you got w? Eh? Good job, Lani. Well done. So that's how you might work through a ditty sheet. Obviously, you can you can play around with it and do some other things too. But if there's any questions, if you're not sure, please don't hesitate to get in touch.